Hi, I'm Michael Young. I'm at Hairspray Studio. Today, what I'm going to do is actually showing you fabulous ideas of actually using hair extensions, clip-on extensions, lots of different things available in this shop. Um, it's just that, I mean, obviously, you know how to do extensions already. So basically, what I'm going to do is just giving you new ideas, new concepts, and just creating different looks. I mean, after all, there's lots of things happening now. There's like bridal, the awards, the devs, and also going to, you know, amazing concert as well. So I'm going to show you a couple of things. So stay watching. Okay, what I've done here is just basically sectioning the hair away, just half of the hair. Now, obviously, for, this is great, particularly for somebody with really fine hair as well. And it's just one piece and the job is done. And the thing is also, in the price range as well, there is, you know, obviously a cheaper version to this. There's human hair and also synthetic hair. In this case, I'm actually doing an upstyle after this. So we don't really need to spend too much money on just using human hair in particular, especially when you're actually going to put the hair up so this piece is perfect it's wavy and it's naturally wavy as so you can see quite natural and the shine is there as well so what I've done is basically sectioning the hair and then I just clip it all on with the clips that are included in the clip-ons and then just place it on then the next thing you do is just drop the hair over the the rest of the hair and it's blended in already what you could do now is just using a little bit of tongue or curl or even GHD just to blend in the wave itself. That's what I'm going to do next. Now, see, as you can see how quickly this prep is, what I've done is actually just basically using a, her own natural hair and just baritone it. If you're doing this yourself, you actually don't have to be so precise. Just take random section, tongue, clip it on, and that's it. You don't even have to tongue the clip-on extensions. That's already curled. So that's how quick and fast this process is. Okay, so what I've done here is almost complete. Now what I'm just going to do is explain to you, after when the roll is set, just get a bristle, a big bristle brush, 
brush it right through so that the curls or the waves are blend into the uh, clip-on extensions. And really, at the end of the day, you don't have to do anything else by just using your hands. It's very much a hand-tied look. The more natural, the better it is and looser it is. As you can see, I didn't actually use a comb whatsoever. I just used my hand, placing the wave that I actually set, placing all that kind of natural, gorgeous wave into the clip-on extensions, and then just clip section by sections and then put it to the one side. But the trick about this is not to have it too asymmetric because otherwise it's going to look like a growth on the side. It's just a tiny bit, just a little bit of volume on the side. There's a nice blending in the waves on the side and then this side here. And then it's okay to have pieces just tumbling down and that's what makes it really soft as well. Now, I'm going to use a little bit of accessorized just to decorate a little bit, you know, some kind of corsages or flowers or something. You can use what you want. Thank you. 